What is up, boys? Ioki here, and today we are playing the other new legendary Leona skin, Lunar Eclipse Leona. Oh my gosh. If you guys haven't already seen my Solar Eclipse Leona video I put out yesterday, I am head over heels in love with these videos from top to bottom. Everything about them I love. Oh, I should have ignited her. Love these skins, man. Uh, but yeah, this is one of the two new skins. This is Lunar Eclipse Leona. Obviously got a very moon. Everything is moon-centered about her, moon-themed. It's got a unique dance animation, playing that weird eerie ballerina music, the same one in the solar one. Uh, there's a couple of different differences. There's a couple of differences between the solar and the lunar eclipse legendary skins that I'm going to be pointing out throughout this video. I really can't decide which one I like better, um, and maybe you guys can, uh, you know, let me know which one you guys like better in the comments, lunar or solar. I think I like the base form on this one better, and I think I like the alt form. Oh, just auto her, dude. Just auto her. We got 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 her. Yeah, I think I like the base form on this one better and the um, the alt form on solar better. I think that I like the alt form on solar better because it, it looks so much different from the base form. Whereas this one, like, the, ba the base form and the alt form look great. They just look kind of similar. There's not, like, a big, like, oomph moment when you alt with this one. Although it does look good. Looks very, very good. Yeah, at this point, I'm just, like, nitpicking. Like, I'm just trying to find things to dislike about these skins because, oh, oh my god, love them, seriously. Is there a new recall animation? And then here, kind of, like, summons that shield. That's easily my favorite part of, easily my favorite part of the skin. All right, went ahead and got first blood. Ooh, four to one. We've already got a really nice lead. But, yeah, sh uh, I like how her, like, snow white hair kind of, like, matches the purplish dark blue black tints of her armor in this one kind of like a neat little contrast they have here here's the new running animation she's got like this very like forward moving momentum to her I, I really really love whereas the other one her old skin she was just kind of like waddling into combat here she's like full force dead ahead running sprinting into combat it looks great gives you a real sense of like speed Alright, Jin, Leona, into Thresh, Jinx. This is a lane that we can absolutely dominate. Especially since we've already gotten a lead. Not gonna miss, not gonna risk missing my E. I'm just gonna walk up to her with the Q. I think she's gonna get out here. I'm gonna back up, back up, back up. No, don't get hooked. Okay, we're good, we're good, we're good. Uh, the nice thing about their jungle is that he's playing Master Yi, who like basically is required to snowball to be useful at all in the early stages and he's already died once so Oof. Jin went in a little, little too deep there I might have to flash if depends if Thresh has flay up actually oh my god I think I'm out holy moly you guys did I just 2v1 that let's go boys all right, I'm going to go back and buy my Mobies. This game is already going better than uh, the game from yesterday. I don't know what happened with that. The game that I was playing, the Solar Leona in, oh my gosh. I mean, check it out for yourself, but that was just just unlucky situation after unlucky situation. This one's going better. Mid is kind of getting shit on, but top's doing really, really well. That's, that's, my, that's my girl She-Wolf. Let's put the spotlight on her, boys. All right, got got his alt. My setup, Udir, for a nice gank. Not gonna use my control. Oh my gosh, what are you doing here, buddy? Am gonna end up using my control ward. Yeah, we can kill this guy. That's so sad. That's so sad. I didn't have a ward to put on the lantern. There's a trick you can do, guys. If Thresh throws the lantern, you can actually just spam wards on it, and he can't move. Uh, he, the person that's trying to get the lantern can't select it. It's a bummer. I wish I hadn't used my control ward over there. I would have put it on the lantern. But we're stacking three in bot lane. Not sure how much use this is going to be. I'm just going to go for the dive. Mm. Ooh, I almost lived, man. I almost lived. We got a two for one there. That's I, I'd say that's an efficient dive at that point. Good stuff, good stuff. Two for one. We got Master Yi off the map, and we got his uh, his flash. Thing is, with the new turret, so there's no way that even if you like shove three people into a lane, and uh, get get a successful dive like that, like before with the old turrets, that probably would have been first turret. 
Hun actually, it would 100% have been first turret. Eight minutes. Yeah. Now, with these turret plating, man, it's hard. Even with a, like a successful roam or play like that, TP play. It's all good. Hopefully Aurelia didn't lose any steam in her lane. I'd hate to ruin a winning lane like that. All right, once we get level six, this, this lane gets a lot easier as well. Okay, Udyr, Master Yi, hi, very highly mechanical battle going on up there, guys. Huge mechanics coming out of that. I'm not gonna go back in until I have my six. Please don't take my cannon. All right, one more minion. Need one more minion. Ooh. Oh my gosh, are you kidding me? No way. Okay, now I need to move out because I'm not sure if Jinx can ult. Yep, there it is, there's the Jinx ult. Got it, kinda wanna put yourself in a weird angle. There we go, baby. You wanna put yourself at a weird angle so that one, the blast radius doesn't hit on Jin and kill you, and two, you just don't get hit by a direct hit. So that's why I kinda like went over to here, backed up over here, I also could've walked over here. You don't wanna just stand next to Jin is what I'm saying. Lots of jinxes, uh, jinx eye? What's the plural of jinx? Jin jinxes. Jinxin. Lots of jinxin. When they're, uh, after a play like that, they need to go, they like to go back here off screen and then shoot the rocket. So you can't see the wind up animation. But if you're 9 million IQ like me, you see it coming. All right, 25 seconds on my alt. We can probably just keep going in over and over again in this lane. We've, we've got a pretty pretty decent lead. Oof, mid is really having a rough time. Jin is lagging, it looks like. Is he gonna be good if I go in? Okay, my alt's in two seconds. I'm just gonna back out of that one. We are standing in a lot of minions. Just popping Relic Shield, trying to keep him healed, trying to keep him healthy. Okay, I'm going in. Damn it. Ah, oh, he didn't flash for the four shot kill either. Oh gosh, where's the Jinx rocket? She might not have it back up yet. I'm kind of like standing behind, beside, uh, behind Jin and at a safe distance so it doesn't hit me. So guys, I'm trying to like treat this game a little more seriously than I did yesterday. A little more in a try hard environment, you know, thinking through what I'm doing, talking with you guys, the uh, the viewers about what I'm doing, trying to give you a more educational experience. If you guys are enjoying this type of commentary, uh, I'm actually starting a Leona only to Diamond series tomorrow on my Twitch channel. Starts tomorrow, November 29th. I'm on, I'm going to be playing only Leona all the way to Diamond. It's going to be a really really good time. And if you play Leona or you play support. And you're always saying things like, uh, you know, how do you get out of low elo as support? Oh my gosh, that's so sad. All right, I got her. Another two v one. So yeah, if you're always asking people, you know, how do you how do you climb as support? How do you climb as out of low elo as, with support? Uh, this is going to be the series for you. There we go, baby. Got them both. Oh no. I don't have any mana. I think we're both dead here. <laughs> eh, Jin might be able to get him, actually. Oh, 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 oh. Hey, there we go, buddy. I didn't get an assist on that, unfortunately. But yeah, guys, if that, if that interests you, uh, my Twitch link is down in the description. I would love to have you guys in chat asking questions. I'm going to be going over build order, when to roam, mechanics, everything. This is going to be a very, very educational, try-hard environment where I'm showing you how to climb a support. Anyways, enough plugging Twitch. Let's focus on the game. Let's kind of look at the state of the game here. Mid is very, very far behind to the point where our mid is going to be useless. Like 
That's that sounds harsh, but our med is our med is going to be useless. Let's clear out the vision she just put. But uh, yeah, we just need to play around the fact that we're not going to be having any AP burst from uh, Ziggs. I think the best shot of carrying this game is to just continue to play like super super aggressively on the on these guys here. All right, so when he throws the lantern, I'm gonna. Ah, it didn't work that time. Bummer. It works about half the time. You spam wards on the lantern and they just can't click it. Hmm. Hey, there you go, boys. There you go, guys. Good job, She Wolf. Alright, turret plating fell off the turrets. Might just be looking at a. Uh, oh, back up, buddy. Take turret shots. Might just look at diving here. Oh. And here's the super fed assassin to kill us. Bummer. I'm dead. That's unfortunate, but it's part of playing a team game. Sometimes your mid is in feeding baboon. And you gotta you gotta deal with that. We could have uh could have had a little more vision in the in the river. I could have seen that coming. Wow, she's gonna be really, really tough to play against though. Our best bet might actually to be um Get just st focus, stop focus on uh, less on killing them in bot lane and more on getting this turret so we can roam and put three people in mid lane. Damn, they're gonna get first turret off that. They killed us once, dude. That's <sighs> all right. Hundred to zero at our turret. All right. Good news is that the deficit in our mid is pretty much equal to the deficit their top has. She's basically doubling Skarner's CS, almost. Uh, Ziggs wants to forfeit, you guys. Ha! <laughs> Funny joke, bud. Is he going for the scuttle? He is. LeBlanc's coming down here. Oh my god, I almost stole it. If he didn't smite it, I was going to steal that. Guys? Guys? What the hell are you guys doing? That was, uh, that was definitely a pretty good opportunity to collapse, but I guess my team didn't see it the same way. It's my fault. All right, we got top. Not bad, not bad. Oh, back out, back out, dude. Back out. If you get hit by CC, you're super dead, dude. I uh, don't like that they're fighting this without us. We got to remember, mid is never going to have priority. Yep, yeah, shouldn't have been over there. We're going to have to rely on getting a lot of pressure from top. Just hope that top can, like, provide so much pressure that we can basically 4v1 LeBlanc. Level 13. This bitch is four levels up. Are you kidding me? Just kind of thinning this wave, holding it out here so it doesn't touch turret. I'd like to get it all the way to this turret while LeBlanc is roaming top. This LeBlanc's just going to run a train on this game. Man, this is going to be... <laughs> It's going to be rough. If we can if we can get it to the turret though, Zig should be able to detonate the turret. Oh, there she is. She's back. Got to back up again. Let's go ahead and make another roam down bot. Hopefully Jin is still alive by the time I get there. I'm going to put a ward here so that we can see if anyone's coming to help them. There's no real way for them to get out at this point. Okay, she's 
dead. Hmm. Questionable teleport here. I think all the action was pretty much already over with. I'd much rather have her on the top side of the map, actually. Help with the, um, the Rift Herald. And holding top, because we're pretty at... At this point, we're pretty much just giving him a free turret, which is bad. But... Mm, try to stop his back there. Didn't get the Turk Cannon. Don't think anyone did. Thank you, Ziggs. Man, this, this mid is just terrible. Look out for LeBlanc. She's looking for free kills, guys. Can upgrade that. Now we're going to have to start stacking some MR. So I'm thinking probably Stone Plate. Mm, she's going to be dead. She's got nothing to dash to. Alright, so that's Flash from LeBlanc. Oh dear, I would go ahead and drop that. Yep. Okay, okay, okay. We got we got a Rift Herald top. That means we just need to pressure mid. Just pressure mid. Pressure, 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 pressure. Okay, LeBlanc is top. He's stopping that. We're going to get a free turret off of this. Hey, it's my first demolish proc of the game, boys. Let's start. Let's start getting some vision out here in the jungle and see if we can cheese them. All right, we're getting out of here. No, 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 Oh, do we have no one else coming? Pop my W should be tanky enough for that. I really thought Aurelia and Ziggs were going to be coming, but... Hmm. That wasn't too bad. <laughs> She's got a 1,000 gold shutdown. Uh, let's go ahead and grab some MR. Uh, LeBlanc's missing, LeBlanc's missing, which means... Oh, no, no, she's, she's still mid, she's still mid. Jesus Christ, she is so fat, dude. I'm still not forfeiting, buddy. I don't really care if you're a loser, I'm not. Yeah, I'm not sure we should be splitting right now. Not quite sure splitting is the right call here. When you've got a lot of lockdown on your team, and they're underneath the turret like this, you basically have free engage... And Aurelia is a champion that needs kind of setup. She can't just like straight up engage. Like she needs time to set up her uh, like her stun and stuff. But that's pretty much what I was providing here. So if we were all right here when they were still under our turret, that kind of that would have been a good would have been a good fight. We don't want to fight without all, all the information, right? We don't want to fight without LeBlanc being without knowing where LeBlanc is. This is so absurd. She's dealing so much damage. Hmm. Even through my MR. She's just super, super fed, you guys. Yeah, we're just not really on the same page. If we, if we could all five stack in one spot, like, I'll land everything on LeBlanc at least once, and we'll kill her that way. But when we're all over the map, we're just not really, like, giving ourselves an opportunity to win this. It's kind of a bummer because it's it's really not a lost game. We're up in turrets. I, I would say a vast majority of their power and gold is in is on uh, LeBlanc. Wow, this dude is this dude is Trick Two G's little cousin. Oh my gosh! Nah, he's gone. He's done. <gasps> nah, he's done. I gotta make sure they don't do Baron. If they don't do Baron, they're probably gonna go to drag or push mid. They might be doing Baron. Okay, okay, okay. Where is LeBlanc though? We gotta we gotta find LeBlanc. Gotta find LeBlanc. LeBlanc might have gone back to buy. Okay, 
We got free kill. Let's go to let's go to Dragon off that. There's LeBlanc. There's Labubulus. That's crazy, man. She's even, like, using, like, multiple combos on me. So it's not that she's, like, deleting our carries. Well, she deleted Ziggs, but she used her combo on me twice. Just kind of unfortunate, man. Mid really, really fell apart. I could see it happening in slow motion, but I really thought the best strategy was to just stay bot and try to pressure that way. I'm not sure I could have played it differently. Uh, it comes down to my forfeit vote. I might just say yes. Might just, oh my god, he went down to 1 HP, you guys. Did you see that? I think I'm going to say yes, just because this, is, uh, this isn't quite a... This, this isn't a ranked game. And I'm afraid that if I vote no, everyone is just going to stop trying. Because that's what people do, is if you, if you vote no to a for, forfeit, they'll just stop trying. So, uh, guys, this was a, this was a video focused on showing you guys the new legendary Le Lunar Leona anyways. So, uh, unfortunately, another L, but, uh, guys, I'm starting my Leona to Diamond tomorrow. Would love to see you in Twitch chat. Let me know what you guys think about the video down in the comments. Peace.